Are you struggling to get coins in Madden 17? Check out the safe and secure MobileMaddenCoins.com. They have coins on all platforms and use the code Ryan at checkout for 10% off. Yo, what is going on, you guys? This is Ryan, back in the Madden 17 Ultimate Team video. And today we got week six team of the week sets and cards in the game. Let's go ahead and take a look briefly at the gold team of the week cards. Just now looking at this right here. We got a Hunter Henry, 83 overall. Victionary is definitely gonna be happy about this. Hunter Henry, he's been he's been, you know, gassing him up a little bit. Like Hunter Henry saying looking like the next Tony G, looking like the next Rob Gronkowski. Obviously trolling, but yeah, we do have him. Barry Church. Kind of a hard-hitting, kind of fast safety, 85 speed, 86 hit power, 92 pursuit, 83 zone coverage with 88 tackle. That's not a bad card at all right there for the Dallas Cowboys defender. Right here we got Case Keenum getting his first team of the week card. 79 speed, 85 throw power, 89 short, 88 medium, and 79 deep. Uh, I mean, if you're a Rams fan, go for it. Uh, next card we have here is Jatavis Brown. So two Chargers golds. Wow, Vic is definitely going to be happy about that. 86 speed, 89 tackle, 85 hit power. So definitely, like he told me, you know, his small height, he makes up for it in his speed and his strength and hit power. So uh, the defensive team of the week hero here we have is Dante Hightower. And here are the cards that you need for the sets. We got a Brandon Cooks with 93 speed, 88 catching, 87 catching traffic, 88 spectacular catch. Uh, not a bad card at all. I mean, everyone's going to want that card for sure with a 93 speed. Uh, there are better receivers out there, but in terms of pure speed receivers, that's amazing. Uh, your typical Derek Johnson, Team of the Week, um, not very fast, uh, but everything else is pretty good. Uh, that's pretty much what you're going to see out of Derek Johnson. Uh, and then we have here Jay Ajayi with 200 yards rushing and a touch. I actually think he got two touchdowns. He does have 88 speed with 88 elusiveness and 88 juke move and a couple of other very balanced attributes at that card. And then Cliff Avril, um, haven't really seen a lot of this card yet. We have 83 speed, 86 acceleration, 89 block shed, and 92 finesse move. That's a beast, guys. Like, Cliff Avril, that's a really good card. All right, and the card in packs is Odell Beckham. Not sure if there's going to be one on the auction block. Doesn't look like it. All right, so we do have six Team of the Week packs and two Team of the Week toppers here. Just testing out the luck. I know a lot of people are going to be like, why are you opening up packs? Didn't you just say, you know, Mutt is dying on Twitter and, you know, boycott packs and stuff like that? I, I mean, I do this for the fun of it. Like, I know packs aren't the greatest. Uh, the Team of the Week packs were pretty nice when they first brought them out. Uh, the next week, they were pretty trash. And, you know, if they're going to be trash this week, probably won't open them up ever again. Like, I just want to open up packs for you guys. It's what I do. Uh, you guys see my contracts up there. We got a Derek Johnson, though. So, 87 overall elite Derek Johnson. Um, I mean, that's pretty good, I guess. Maybe that's just beginner's luck out of the Team of the Week packs this week. And a Brandon Graham. So, two elites out of one of the packs here. Not bad at all. Derek Johnson, Brandon Graham. Moving on to the next pack. Let's see what we can get here. We got a Byron Jones of the Dallas Cowboys. Brandon Selleck. Uh, Nolan Carroll. We're going to get a lot of old Team of the Weeks, I believe, here. Hunter Henry. We got a DeMarco Murray in there. And a Doriel green beckham so another hunter henry 83 overall tight end for the chargers next pack we got ourselves a tj jones we got a vic beasley we got a rolando mclean bruce Irvin, a case keenum there's a new team of the week card and a deshaun shed someone corrected me and said his name is deshaun shed ryan stop calling him deshaun sheed uh i could definitely see why that would piss you off it, def it definitely does look like shed now that i'm looking at it uh, I don't know. I, I just don't really know how to pronounce people's names if I've never heard them pronounced. Uh, Barry Church pops out of that pack. So, yeah, definitely looks like I got lucky with that elite Hunter Henry in this pack. Um, a lot of people were saying, like, last week's Team of the Week packs had zero elites in them. Like, a lot of people uploaded, you know, videos, and no one really pulled too many crazy cards. Uh, but that first week, man, that was insane. We were getting a ton of elite Team of the Weeks out of the Team of the Week pack. So, I mean, like I said, maybe they did bump up the odds just to get everyone excited as we get an elite pool. Hey, there we go. Brandon Cooks, 87 overall Brandon Cooks as I'm talking about it. So maybe they're heating up a little bit. Another case, Keenum. There's a Brandon Cooks. Like I said, 93 speed. Does have 91 elusiveness. He's a, just a totally fast card. Like, if you need the receiver to do anything in the slot or maybe just go deep, Brandon Cooks is your man. Definitely go out and pick him up. Um, definitely one of the fastest receivers in the NFL. And we're already done with our Team of the Week packs. Now we just got the toppers left. So Mark Barron is going to be in the topper. And then we're also going to get a Michael Crabtree. So definitely uh, you can get a lot of old cards in these packs right here. And there, Bruce Irvin. 85 overall Bruce Irvin. I'll take that. Two Raiders, one Bruce Irvin. 
That's from week one, guys. That's to get the AJ Green. That might be rare. Like, that might have some value. Definitely happy about that. So definitely uh, Bruce Irvin, Michael Crabtree, Mark Barron, and another Michael Crabtree to go out of the toppers. Not bad. Do have a couple of points left over. Let's go ahead and rip some single packs. Can we get lucky with another elite here as we get Vandal Alexander, Elvis Doomerville, Sharif Floyd, Dontrell Searcy. We got Case Keenum again. We got, what is that name? Ronis Nuchez. We got Derek Johnson again. Let's go. So we're actually pulling elites right now. This is crazy. Uh, I don't know if the whole um, thing on Twitter with Toke or whatever got them to, you know, bump up the odds a little bit again. But if they're doing that, like if they're bumping up the odds because people are complaining, like that's cool and all. But why not just keep the odds the same? Like why not just make it better and keep it there? Why do you have to keep changing it? Cliff Avril. See, these are definitely juiced. I'm not saying that I personally have juice packs, but they definitely juiced the Team of the Week packs because everybody was complaining again. All right, guys, so I just finished the Lamar Miller set. Uh, he is kind of a beast. If you guys want to take a look at what he is compared to AP and uh, Ezekiel Elliott, like, look at that. That's the AP that everybody hates to go against. Lamar Miller's better in everything besides trucking. Now, here he is against Ezekiel Elliott. Again, better in everything. That is insane. Like, wow. All right, guys, so now we got three Team of the Week player packs here, elite player packs, hoping for another Brandon Cooks. Uh, we do get a Cliff Avril in the first one. Moving on to the second one, we're going to go ahead and get ourselves a another Cliff Avril. So that's not good. And then we finish off with a J Ajayi. So those are the Team of the Week cards. If you guys want to pull a bundle, hopefully I gave you a little bit of a you know insight on what is going to be in the packs if they're juiced or not they definitely seem a little bit more juiced than last week go ahead and rip some bundles if you want to and if not it's all good go ahead and give the video a like if you enjoyed subscribe if you are new and i'll catch you guys later peace